here with Hawkeye head coach Richard Nuttall following a 4-2 loss to South Florida in the first round of the NCAA tournament. Coach, thoughts on tonight's team? Yeah, first of all, congrats to uh, USF. They played a good game and scored some good goals against us, but I thought it was a game that, uh, you know, was reliant on two or three pivotal moments that didn't go our way. And, uh, you know, we went 1-0 up, should have gone probably 2-0 up and didn't. And then they've come back and scored a great goal. But the, the, the first moment was the goal, I think, with 29 seconds to go just before the half. Uh, we didn't do ourselves justice defending the corner, didn't attack the ball. And for some, you know, reason, it just managed to find its way in, whatever reason it was. And then we were 2-1 down at half time instead of 1-1. And then immediately after the second half, you know, we thought a little bit of a, a foul occurred. Uh, I'll have to look at the video, but then we're 3-1 down and that was a sort of game over at that time. And uh, then they've got a fourth, we've got one back, 4-2, and we've had two or three chances to make it 4-3. He hasn't done and, you know, they've won the game. But they're a very talented side, they're good on the ball, they move the ball well. And uh, again, credit to those guys. I know it's it's raw and and really quickly but just you know right now your quick thoughts on on this season that that just occurred well we've had a great season but you're always disappointed at the uh, when it end, ends you know we thought we could have gone on from here but um i think we're a little bit fatigued we've, we've played seven away games in the last i don't know 20 odd days and including actually seven flights so far so a little bit fatigued a little bit tired we have a few regrets, which you know I don't like. Uh, I would like to come out without any regrets, but uh, definitely have a few. And uh, but that's life. We've got to keep moving. We've got a great group already for next year returning. I'm happy for the seniors, the four seniors who are graduating. They're going on to do great things in life. I know they will. Great group of uh, young men. And uh, overall, we're looking forward already to uh, next year. All right, coach. Thank you for your time. Thank you.